what you say. Hey, Brett. Hey, Leanne. Oh. oh. I'm glad you made it. So how the auditions going? Good. I settled on two actors. I think that really captured our likeness. He's playing you? Yeah. He must have a lot of range. Okay, let's take it from um, page 80, scene 12, the breakup scene, guys. Excuse me, but, but what's our character's motivation here? Yeah, how do you want this scene to play? Okay, for now we'll do line readings and then find our character's arc as we go along. Okay, Allison, why don't you take it from the line, uh, let's try this again, Brett, are you happy? Brett, this is so cool. Can I see a script? Yeah, take mine. Oh, cool. Oh, my God. I don't believe this. I know, you can say it. Unprecedented greatness. I don't know what to say. Here, let me help you. Brett Hodson, super genius. No, that's not it. Okay, what were you going to say? I was going to ask if you found a publisher for this fiction. What are you talking about? I quoted you warmly and accurately. Warmly and accurately? You made me a stripper and called me smack whore. Everybody's a critic. Yeah, when you call me smack whore. Well, I guess we'll just agree to disagree then. You need therapy. This is my therapy. You write in your diary, I write an indie flick. Yeah, but at least my diary isn't on public display for the community. We all cope in our own way. Now, aren't you glad you got that off your chest, Brett? And as usual, smack whore, I have you to thank for it. What? You're an idiot. What are you so upset about? This is a total character assassination on me. That is so not true. And besides, I changed your name. Yeah, to smack whore. Jeez, I thought you'd be a little more grateful, Leanne. <laughs> you thought I would be grateful. You're immortalized now. As smack whore, the nocturnal stripper. God, I guess there's just no charming you, is there, Leanne? Sorry, I guess I'm just high maintenance. Excuse me, Brett, would you like that with a southern accent? Sure, let's try that. Hello, I don't have a southern accent. Oh, honey, this isn't about you. Actually, it is. Brett, who is this person? Uh, she's the girl your character's based on. Oh, I love the part of you. She really speaks to me. Yeah, not in a southern accent. Well, what accent would you use? Um, this one? Yeah, no, my character wouldn't do that. Where do you find these people? Brett, I just want to say I love this role. I mean, you understand. You know, we're keeping it real. We're from the streets. Yeah, actually, I'm from suburbia. A week no pain, bro. So how do you want me to say this line, anyway? With uh, punch and, and force. You know, I wouldn't do that if I were you. And I am you. Again, where do you find these people? Okay, let's take it from the top. Hold on. I need to prepare. You were always trying to put words in my mouth, and you finally succeeded. And don't think I don't see what you're doing. You're using your writing to meet chicks. You know I'm a slave to my art. You know that, Leanne. You're a dumbass. Okay, I'm ready! Okay, go! Look, at least take solace of the fact that I kept the integrity of our relationship intact. Boy, you really matured, Brett. Yeah. I've got to go. I've got something I need to take care of. Wait, Brett, don't go. I can't bear to see you leave. Don't leave me. I love you. I'll do anything to be with you. I can't live without you. My life has no meaning. I'll be your sex slave. What? Where do you come up with this crap? Excuse me, Um, I have a problem with this part. She comes off as not bitchy. Yeah. Yeah, I don't buy that. Brett, my character's white. I don't think he would do that. We'll be in touch. Where do I 
find these people? Crap. Jesus, God. Hey, John, it's Brett. Yes, I finished the script. I'm calling it the last word? Because it is the last word. I got nothing left to say. Look, I can't take this tortured lifestyle anymore of being an artist. And besides, it's not like true love is going to come walking up through my front door. Which reminds me, I need to put some money in the jukebox. Let me call you back, John.